Hey everybody, many of you have commented on how great our new Tallwinds jerseys look. It's all thanks to the Custom Fuse online customization tool. And special thanks to my wife for helping me design the jerseys and shorts for 2020. I'll be holding a contest where you can win a number 44 Tall Ones jersey signed by me and a $100 e-gift certificate to All Volleyball. You will need to use the Custom Fuse app to create your own version of the Tall Ones jersey and shorts, and I will choose the best one. All submissions must be received by February 15th. I'll leave the instructions on how to enter this contest in the description box below. Good luck! What's up guys, this is Coach Starney with ElevateYourself.org. Right now it's 7 a.m. on Saturday morning and I'm here to set up for our very first Elevate Volleyball League tournament of 2020. And we are here at the Mountain View Volleyball Club facility. Here's all the tournament gear we got. Waters for everybody, the game balls. Got my lunch, snacks, and drinks. Tournament box of scoreboards. And our new custom fused jerseys for the 2020 season. Can't wait to show them to you guys. And now it's time to set the nets up. If I can have everyone come in for a quick meeting, please. Come on over here. Welcome to our very first LBA Volleyball League tournament. This is our third year going. Uh, we also have a no douchebag policy. <laughs> it's our most famous policy. So if you see a douchebag, point him out and we'll jump him. Right? <laughs> Just be respectful. Special thanks to the Toyos Family Bakery for Ladies providing the spread. In the world. Oh, and yeah. I'm Eastern, oh, so yeah. I get to honorarily say a Toyos is. Yeah, you heard it from the source. Victoria, we got a variety of naans, lavash bread, pita bread. I think they sell it at Trader Joe's in a lot of stores. Nutella, cream cheese. What's this? Ooh, unfiltered honey. Warm up time. We're off the first round. We get to watch some volleyball. It's the first round today. This is Stuffed Curry versus Namaste. New team here, Namaste in Green. You'll recognize them from the Summer League too. And then Bay, got some new players this year. Against the team over there, a new team also, Burgess. And now you guys get to meet the new tall ones. Stay tuned for the end of the vlog because I'll explain why the fun ones split up and actually why Slam Squad split up. So make sure you watch all the way to the end. Hi, my name is Ryan Dedrick. I'm 6'8, I'm a middle, and I love cows. And where'd you play? San Jose State. Right. You, you call yourself 6'8? Don't, don't dare you say any other height to him. 6'8? Don't straight. dare. Don't you dare. Right. Uh, hi, Ian Wright. Uh, middle blocker, 6'7", played at USC. You know the drill, Aquaman. What's up? Chris Brett Kaisen, six foot two and seven eighths, I found out. Just shy and uh, left the opposite. Okay. And I don't have my trident today, so. <laughs> we'll bring it next time. I'll bring it next time for sure. <laughs> uh, I'm Nick, uh, I play outside. I went to UC San Diego and I'm 6'2", six 6'3", six on a good day. There you go. I'm Ryan Bridge. I'm a setter. I'm 6'4", and I play club at UC San Diego. 
Hi everyone, I'm Parsha Rezvani. I'm 5 feet 8 inches tall. I like to say I'm 5'9", but that's false. I play club at UCLA, uh, and I'm back here in the Bay Area playing with Elevate. Today I'm going to wear my trusty Adidas Explosive Bounce for some extra cushion, support, and lots of grip. Let's hope my knee can hold up today. And my knee feels really good. That's our first official victory of the brand new tall ones. So can't wait for the rest of the day, but no knee pain at all. As you can see, I'm still a little bit off. I'm missing some really, really good sets from Ryan. Nobody up and I still waffle it. Uh, most important thing is when you're trying to find your rhythm, don't back off. Keep going in your same mental rhythm that you're used to until your body finds it, uh, especially early in the day. You gotta figure it out now so you don't have to think about it in playoffs because you don't want to be passive in playoffs. Now it's time for the third round of pool play. There is a sighting of Aquaman.
Just won that second one pretty handily, and our team is firing on all cylinders. I still don't feel in rhythm with my hitting just because I haven't spiked in a long time in game. As you can see, I'm hitting a lot of like wrists. It's crossing my right shoulder, kind of funky in the air, but I, I got to stay aggressive. Even on my serving, I lost my rhythm a, a little bit, just a little bit rusty. Got to keep doing it until it starts working. So hopefully by the playoffs, I will find my rhythm. The next thing we're going to play is pretty solid bay, upgraded from last year. So that'll be a good test to prepare us for playoffs. Time to eat lunch. Got this packaged lentils and ground beef and beans. Lean, good carbs and high protein. Ooh. 26 26 cap at 27 this is do or die sets a holic versus burgess oh Woo. that's a game right there Yeah. 